Hey, my name is Brady from ROG Ally Pro, and today I'm going to show you how to play GeForce Now games on your ROG Ally. And for those of you that don't know, GeForce Now is a cloud streaming gaming service where you can play over 1,500 games all from all types of storefronts like Epic Games, Steam, EA, and all of those, even Game Pass. And this allows you to play games on your ROG Ally that might not be able to handle it as well. And you can also play it on like other laptops and a PC too if you want. All you really need to do is just connect your account to it and it'll be working and up and ready to go. So let's get it added on our ROG Ally here. So just open up your browser of choice. My browser will be Chrome. Have it open Chrome in a minute as you can see. Now just look up GeForce Now. And it'll be this first one here. It'll be GeForce Now and Video. And then you get this privacy screen. You gotta scroll down and agree and continue. And then from here, you just wanna click on this get in button. And then it'll take you to this screen where you just have to log in to your NVIDIA account. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, then once you're logged into NVIDIA, you'll have to either subscribe for $19 a month or $20 a month. Or if you want to pay for six months it'll be a hundred bucks or if you haven't played before you can do this free one you only get a basic rig one hour play length that's ad supported otherwise if you were to join the paid version of it you get a premium rig six hours session length up to 1080p and up to 60 fps but i'm gonna just do the free for now so just click join you can do it on the paid one too if you want and we wait for this to load then you just click play now with the free one and then just so we get the best experience i'm just going to download the geforce now app you guys don't have to do this but i recommend it so you just want to click download for windows wait for it to install here okay then if you install the geforce now app you're just gonna have to sign in one more time it'll bring you back to your browser so you just sign in then it should redirect you right back to the app. Or just close that and open up GeForce now. And there we go, we got all our games here, but all you need to do is connect your store account so you can play your games you already purchased. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, just so we could test in this video, I linked my Epic Games account as well as my Steam account. So we'll try one on both of them. Okay, and you want to pick your streaming quality if you want it to be a competitive experience. If you're playing a fast-paced game, you want to pick that. If you want something that takes less data, just use Data Saver. And then if you want to upgrade your account, you got it on the left side here. It just tells you everything about the premium membership if you want to go ahead and, up, go ahead and upgrade to that. But we're going to try playing a game now. So come to your game section in the drop down on the side. And when you're on this homepage here, you got my library here, two of four accounts connected or however many accounts you connected. You can just see all your games right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and try Fortnite to start off with. So let me find that and load it up. And then once you're on the actual game screen, you just wanna go ahead and click play. And now it'll connect you. Sometimes if it is busy, it'll have some people that are going ahead of you and this is for let me just mute that, sorry about that. So if someone is on a premium rig, they'll be put ahead of you. So you just gotta wait for this countdown to go down. And if you wanted priority access, you just click this upgrade button to upgrade your account. But I will catch you guys after I'm done waiting in this queue. All right, now that we're loaded in, you can see pretty much like the same as if you were to have downloaded the game onto your ROG Ally, but I will see you guys in game just to show you the performance on the free version of GeForce Now. Okay, as you can see, I'm kind of flying down right now. We're at a stable 60 FPS, really. So, and this is on, I think this is the lowest performance that we have right now, since we're just on 720p, because that's the max that you can do for the free version of GeForce Now. But yeah, this is what it's like playing through the free, free version of it. And you can obviously upgrade to the premium one if you want a better quality and you got internet that is good enough to support it often. And I've noticed that it's 
quite jumpy, at least for me. Maybe that's some of my Wi-Fi, but it just lags a lot. Not entirely sure about that. Let's see if I can get this guy. Hope someone else is definitely shooting at him. I got the kill, but some guy over on that building. That is a real person. And I'm getting shot from behind. And I got killed. But, yeah. That was Fortnite on GeForce Now. And I'll catch you back when we're on the GeForce Now app. Okay. Here we go. Now we're back on the GeForce Now app. And that is how you guys use GeForce Now on the ROG Ally. And you can play all your games in your library. Pretty much all your games in the library. Not going to say every single one. But you can play most of them. So, you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe and if you are interested in more rog ally content check out our youtube channel we post only rog ally guides tips tricks and all that and also check out our website where we also post guides tips tricks game settings and all that for the asus rog ally but thank you guys for watching and have a good rest of your day